The next one says, how many articles should show intro text? How many columns should there be? Because you can make this five columns, although it would look really stupid. Usually the option is one or two columns of text is what you want. You can if you change this to one, then you won't have columns, basically. You just have a full page, and you'll have each article. Number of links. Usually you're not going to have any pages as links, so you can change that to zero. Okay, so these are the options, and you can play with this. You can, you can change it, you can apply, go back to the front end, refresh. In this case, you don't really see the difference because this article is so short. But normally, it would go, it would, it would go all the way across now because I said it should only be one column. Okay. Does everyone understand? Play with this a bit. Everyone change something on there and see how it looks. Okay. Is, is this a feature of the template? No, this is all part of Joomla. And it's hidden in the home page menu item. Everyone there? I understand what you just said. This is this will whatever template you're using. It doesn't this, matter what template. This will this will modify that template. It doesn't modify the template. It modifies how the content is displayed. So it's still just dealing with content, not with design. But for us, content can be in one column or two columns. That's a function of Joomla, not of the template. So this is where you control how many columns there are. For example, does that make sense? No. No. Because to me, two columns is a template. Okay. It's a template. There are two columns of data. Well, in this case, it's all appearing in one place. It's all appearing inside of the content main, menu, main area of the page. So Joomla lets you put that content in one column or two columns without any regard to the template at all. And the way to describe this is so this is your page. This is your main menu. And this is your article right now, right? The first one. And then to the second one. So this is your text uh, space. And what Tamar is showing you how to do is how to have the same articles be displayed as either as horizontal pieces of information or as vertical pieces of information is one article here and one art article there, one article here and one article there. But how is that different than a template? Template, and I, don't, I see what you're saying. I'll, I'll, hold on just a moment. So the difference in the template, and it's a great question, is in some templates, you also will have a menu here, or as Tamara was showing, um, events here, or calendar or something. So it will have modules. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But as far as the template and Joomla are concerned, your main text stays the same. So it's, it's a good question. It takes a little bit to get there. Basically, think of this as your main text, and you have all the liberty to apply your articles the way you want. You can either have just one article, or you can have four of them with just snippets displayed. So templates will have a section that's your main module and right. it's this particular section that we're now modifying and that will be fairly consistent from template to template to template. It's, it's not a module position. No, it's not a module and position. Your main content text. is basically just the content area. Okay. Modules usually kind of hang out around the content area, but the main thing is not a module. It's just where your so content it's is. Text right. It's also the place where your component your calendar would display if you have a component for a calendar. It's the kind of the central area where things show up. Now in terms of the template you could have a template, for example, that would change how the let me just show you how the title looks on here. That's something the template would control. If this is purple and like three feet tall, the template would control that. The, 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 color, the color of the text, the font of the text, the size of the text, the template's controlling all of that. The template isn't controlling how many articles appear and whether, what order they appear in and whether there's one or more columns of Am text. I um, on the back end, create four of these articles, you know, just copy the same articles okay. and create four of them so that you could display four okay. of them on the same page and then apply a different template. Okay. So what we're going to do just for the sake of this example, and you can just uh, look at it on the board, we're going to recreate the same articles. And now we have many more and we're going to publish them on the front page. What on earth? <laughs> okay, one second.
All I'm doing right now is creating more copies of the same articles. It's nothing you'll need to worry about. And we're just doing this for the sake of the example so that the content part is OK, so right now we have a, we have a one column layout. Does everyone see that there's only one column on this page in the text? Okay. We have multiple articles showing. We have four because I think that's what we said is a limit. We go back over here. We go to menus, main menu, home. And we change this. We want to have um, two things show all the way across. And we want to have two columns. Apply, home, refresh. Two things are now showing all the way across. And then there's two columns underneath. So it makes sense. So this is some place where you can play a lot. You can see how you like it with one column or two columns. Don't do more than two columns because it's just confusing. Um, and how many articles you want, it, you want to display on this. Okay. Can it be 0 and 4? Can it be 0 and 2 and 0? OK, of course. And this way, no articles are going to display all the way across. They're all going to be like that. So does that make sense? Just want, does that make sense? I understand what it's doing. That's not my question. I mean, my question is, how is that different from a template? Because to like maybe my what the word I use template means something than what you're meaning, and so I don't understand. Are you telling me that in an actual template that I download, there's just a big old text box, and then I'm formatting that text box in this? The template itself, um, templates control basically CSS. Okay. CSS. Template controls. Um, so there's ways to style um, articles. There's ways to style text. There's ways to change colors of text. I don't care about that. I just want to like put this stuff into one big old text box or okay. two text box or whatever. Okay. So the articles you create are not dependent on the template itself. Okay. The articles are your content, and Joomla will store your content regardless. Doesn't matter what template you have on there. When you change the template. Things that might change in terms of how the article appears are stuff like the font or the, you know, the title, stuff like that. The independent of the template, Joomla lets you set up multiple columns on your home page like that and say how many articles you want. You're, you're going to go in, you're going to create your articles, you're going to decide what you want on the front page, and you're going to publish it to the front page. Let's, let's, let's give a specific example. Give me a specific example of what you're trying to do. I don't know what I'm trying to do. You can just well, move on. I'll figure it out. I, I thought, for example, that a template would have um, maybe a left-hand side column that might have a calendar on it, might have a blog section that's already pre-established, in a sense, yep. so that these, uh, the appearance, not just the colors or the fonts, would, in a sense, be populated with some of these modules I otherwise can use myself to fully enhance the a website. A template will have, um, what a template has is it has module positions does not have a place for a blog. Um, what it does is it has, it has left, it has right, it has all the stuff we took a look at before. And we did question mark TP equals 1. And it has specific formatting for each of these areas. So it might have different formatting for the right than on the left. OK, okay. okay. Let's, let's go with this. If you can form a promise. Let's recreate this menu as, as only right hand side. It will keep for my promise. 